Golden Sheik Warblers are unique in the sense that they nest nowhere else in the world but in Central Texas. There's no other bird in the world that you can say that about, but Golden Sheik Warblers, everyone is a native Texan because everyone was born here. Uh, I found a nest two days ago. There's a female Golden Sheik Warbler. The female does all the building. Primarily the bark of ash juniper trees for the structure of the nest, and then she binds it together with sticking materials like spider webbing. The golden cheek warbler is only going to breed in this particular habitat. They build their nest out of ash juniper bark and they've evolved over the thousands of years this relationship with the tree. A lot of the forest areas that used to house golden cheek warblers are now housing human beings. So much of the reason for the species being listed as endangered has been because of changes that we've made to the landscape. Because there's higher densities of predators at the urban edge, that's a much more dangerous environment for the endangered golden cheek warbler. Um, in the past, we've had a researcher who has been able to put cameras on nests and has actually taken film, and she was able to catch certain predators at the nest. You know, we watch these nests uh, from the beginning. We, you know, see them go through the egg laying process, the nestling process, and many times just before they fledge, uh, we'll lose them. It's a tough thing to watch because, you know, we've gotten to know these birds over a long period of time. One of the great things about the Balcones Canyonland Preserve is it's now coming back that we have trees here that are over 100 years old. We're setting the stage here for the return of those old growth forests. Golden Cheek Warbler is continuing to face pressures from urban growth, from changes that we are doing to its habitat and to the planet. We hope with the establishment of the Balcones Canyonlands Preserve, putting this land in some protection that we can help them to survive into the future.